Hello everybody, welcome back to Generation Zero. In the last episode, we made our way from down this way. Uh, we kind of moved up, trying to head up to... Oh no, it's gone. Oh no, no, maybe... Okay, oh, I see. Oh, okay, we had, a, we had a waypoint for a mission here, and it, it disappeared. But I think what happened... Um, I think what happened is when we came up here and uh, we saw the opening, I think it's that right there. Um, well, geez, I don't know. There's a road that goes up to it. I think the mission marker was back here and we saw this. I planted a radio over here. Apparently, I don't know what the radios do. I thought you could, I thought you could, 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 um, fast travel to the radios. You can't, I thought you could resurrect off the radios. You can't, I don't know what the radios do. I don't know. Um, anywho, last episode made our way from down here all the way. Oh, there's a mission down here now. Uh, I guess we walked right past it. I don't know. We walked all the way up here. There's something that we have to do up here. I don't know what it is. I've already kind of lost my way, but we'll get the bike out. We'll take the bike up there. We'll blow up some robots. That can't be a bad thing, right? Right. I mean, all we have to do is just wait for the, the cavalry to show up. You know what I mean? I don't remember. I don't remember the door having the boards over it. Maybe, yeah, maybe it did, and I just didn't realize it. That's the only vehicle I have is the bike. I don't have the the whatever, the moped. All right. I think we went out this time last time. I think I think it's it's a little weird to do, but I think we figured it out. <clears throat> I think it's over here. Okay, there we go. All right. We're on our way. We are on our way. Right? Yeah. I've been playing the, uh, yeah, this, this game, if you ever wanted to make like a spooky game, this definitely could be a spooky game. Super, super good, uh, ambiance for spookiness. I wonder how you make a good spooky game. I was just thinking like maybe zombies, right? Like werewolves or something. But like, how do you make a good spooky game? Like what would be the, there's, um, if you, you ever know the call of Cthulhu written by, um, what's the guy's name? Lovecraft, Lovecraft. That sounds made up <laughs> anyway. So this dude writes a book, right? And apparently, um, I forget if it's a detective or a police officer or a journalist, uh, but somebody comes upon this cult and they take it upon themselves to investigate the cult at length. Just a box there with a cabbage next to it. And he finds out that the cult, um, like there's a, like in all the major cities, there's like a handful of people who there's that place, by the way. Yeah, I know you see me. And we're in... Yeah, we're in it. I love the hunting rifle. I love the hunting rifle. But anywho, he has a character called Cthulhu. And... The whole idea behind Cthulhu is that you can't kill him. You can just, you, maybe you survive him. And if you do survive him, then perhaps maybe you don't even have your sanity intact. That's a doggo. We'll wait for him to come. Ha <laughs> 
love the hunting rifle. Absolutely love the hunting rifle. Um, and if you survive them, you're not going to have your sanity intact. And, and by sanity not intact, I mean, not like, oh, old Mr. Gusterson has a million dollars worth of brains in his basement. No, no. Like, you eat your own hair and you, you don't know what's what and you don't. Like you're 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 in you're in extended care for the rest of your days type type situation. You know what I mean? So if you're making a horror game, oh, someone took one of these guys down. Good job, everybody. Super duper impressed. All right. We only have 117 rounds of this. We probably need to make more. Uh, 7.62. Uh, ammunition. If we can, we probably don't even have the... We probably do not have the schematic. That is the weirdest... Dual purpose round, high explosive, dual purpose round. I hope that is what goes inside. What Whatever it is. Let me go look here. My goodness, we have we have point five zero full metal jacket rounds. It has a, it has the symbol of the the submachine gun. I don't know why. I, I was I would think that would be to the sniper rifle. Interesting. It would be nice if, if there was more information about this thing. Like, I don't know. My cat is on my feet he, he got mad last night because uh i haven't really been hanging out with him okay well now look we picked up two just then and we have one in the chamber and we have one on on in our pocket so i think i think those are those high explosive um whatever i think i think those are what we're looking for i can't open these oh nice a little first aid kit laying there uh, I forgot how to turn on my flashlight, too. These boys, these guys right here, killed a doggo, another doggo, and then a, a, a big guy. And then they went back there, and they they were eating apples, trying to enjoy their day, and, and I guess died of... I don't know, man. Like, doesn't this look ritualistic? I, it doesn't look uh, it doesn't look right to me. <laughs> Looks like something weird happened. I think that's all there is here at this little location, which is nice because I, I thought we were going to get um, sidetracked from the original mission. I got to figure out how to turn on the flashlight. F. I bet you guys out there are more excited now walking in here. <laughs> Because you can actually see. Me too. Yeah, they did good. They did good. Okay. All right. Well, we'll need all that. No, no, no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Turn off the flashlight. You cannot have the flashlight. You can't toggle the flashlight while you're in while you're in aiming mode. I want that canister right there. Uh oh, spaghettios! Oh, he he juked it. Didn't do that one, did you, there, buddy? Oh. Hell. What was that? I love the hunting rifle. Reloading. Uh huh. I knew that was bad. I knew that was bad. 
<laughs> ah. All right, let's break this out. Uh oh. You guys hear that? What was that noise? What was that noise? What was that noise, Tate or Precious? Give me my hunting rifle. Give me my hunting rifle. I swear. I swear on me, mum. There's no way out. I don't see the guy who's suppressing us. There he is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Run on. Run on in here, buddy. What is that, a container full? What do you think? Killing, you know, that's about as far as they got, huh? Let's see him. Now stop. How many doggos are there assigned to this area? 2,000? 3,000? There's something else over there. At least I'm outside now. Their programming hasn't updated. They've been doing the same thing the others did. Just stop for one second, buddy. Or don't. Alright, are we good now? I think we're good. Looted you. There's my bike. Nope, that's not my bike. Oh, I had to lockpick that. That was locked. Well, that that was that was good for us. That was uh, that was a fantastic. That's a fantastic engagement. An adrenaline shot. We need one of those. That's what lets us get back up if we get uh, if we get knocked out. We don't have one. That, we have one now. Oh, we have two now. What a wonderful little find. Is that a backpack? Sure is. Got some first aid kits, got some adrenaline shots, and we got the, the more ammunition for the big guy. We had two. Now let's look. Now let's look. Now, now let's look. Now let's look. Now we have four. Cool. So those things are referred to as dual purpose, high explosive rounds. Good. Good, good, good. So we're only a couple of, of points away from being able to manufacture those in-house. And at that point, I don't see why we just don't go murder every single robot that we can find. Oh, we found a blueprint. Yay. You want to tell me what the blueprint was? Uh, explosive and apparel schematic. Ooh, we all like that apparel. Uh-oh, the big guy is walking over here. I hear him. Man, the the, the big guy. I I I ugh. just just knowing just knowing that he is alive and exists, it angers me. It angers me. You know what I mean? Like hearing him, hearing look like bloom. Bloom. Like it just mm. 
Mainly because I've killed him like two or three times, or killed some of his kind before. Now, where was the um, where was the the pain of whatever? We got the the crossed red swords, and it was like, oh, you, something spawned, some kind of bad guy. I knew about that. I knew about the base. There it is. There it is. He's down there. The tyrant of Machenberg. Machen back in Mach back in. I don't know. He's a tyrant. He's down there. His days are numbered. We have 212 rounds now, up from 119. So that's pretty good. And I find a way in. No, what? 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 So this is one of them bases, and I'm supposed to find a way inside to sabotage it. Okay. I did not know that's what we were doing on this mission here. Look, it's snow. That's cool. I've not seen snow here yet. Maybe I have. Kind of neat how you get to a certain height, and it's just like, okay, now it's snowy. <laughs> Are you a person? No, you're a you're a you're just a light. Okay. Let me come over here. That is absolutely horrible to hear. I'm recording, right? Yeah. Yuck. Okay, this, this place doesn't look as bad as the other place. I don't know what that is. I don't like this the sound of that, though. Got a bad feeling about this. Um, what is my deal here? I got, I got x-ray vision. Oh, don't stand up. Don't stand up. Sit back down. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. He turns around. We're going to give it to him right in his back. Do oh, turn around, buddy. Turn around. Come on, give us a shot at your back. I think I have any. Oh, there we go. I got six. Nice. Is that up to full? Perfect. All right. What, what's attacking me? What's attacking me? Is it? Was it a turret? Negative. It's doggos. Oh, that explosion got the other one, too. All right, three doggos down. There's a fourth. He's standing behind a tree, too. Oh, wow. A prolonged burst there from that doggo. Can't seem to get his... Is hydrogen tank. I can't really see it. Here he comes. Okay. Alright, one big guy and four doggos. That's what we got so far. A schematic. What was that? First aid kit? Something else, like some tax or something. Lead. Lead. All right. The big guys, if you shoot them in the back with a rocket launcher, you instantly kill them. That is great to know. It is, it is good to know information here. Where is his body at? Really? He died over there? I didn't think it was over there.
Okay. Well, we're here. It's locked and locked, it says. Okay. Maybe I disable the transmitters or something here. Come on now. That right there looks like it can be blowed up. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That not like it can be blowed up? That looks like to me it can be blowed up. Little transmitting dish there. Hey buddy. I I don't know, man. I guess I guess we try it. Um Please tell me we picked up one of them. There's a small fuel cell. Oh, small EMP. A small batter, pack of battery cells rigged to trigger an electromagnetic pulse when hit. All right, so we drop this, we shoot it, see what happens. Oh, my, my game is frozen here. Stand by, let me... There we go. Sometimes my... My games will freeze. I have to alt tab and come back in. A small fuel storage cell salvaged from the wreckage of a destroyed machine. They can be placed on the ground and used as an explosive when shot. Okay. So what if I blow up? What if I place one of these? Deployed. And one of these. There we go. Okay, they're, they're both here. Right, right. Hold on, did I deploy that? Oh, I did. I deployed it up there. Oh, how cool is that? And then you. Um, really, really weird. How am I supposed to? I guess I need to deploy it. Oh, I, I bet it wouldn't deploy it because there wasn't room for it. You can only deploy like one thing at a time. Well, where is it? I picked it up. Is it going to be at the top? Is this not in order of... Oh my gosh, it's in order of what you picked up last. Um... Assign it to a slot. We'll assign it to slot number two because number two doesn't work anyway. So, okay. Oh Jesus! It's a grenade. Not when placed. It's a grenade. I don't know. Are we? Are we? What are we doing? What are we doing? Where's our mission? <laughs> What's what are we supposed to be doing right now? Log? Side missions. That's what I'm on right now. Okay, destroy enough machines to get inside the bunker. Look for the command bunker in the forest region. Find the war board. Okay, geez. Building blocks. Find the patro patrol map. Okay. There's the note that I have. I don't know. How do I set that one as active? Oh, oh, is it the bottom? Track R. Ah. Okay. Yeah, that's not here. That's total defense. That's the side. Oh, dang it! Is it? Is it? That was I was supposed to go there. Oh come on! I have no idea. I have no idea where I was supposed to go or what I was supposed to do. I, I thought it was up here. I don't know why you watch the channel either. I, I, I will watch some people and I will get so mad at how they play the game. Like, what are you doing? There was one guy. I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't say who it was, but he's playing the dark and darker, right? And he keeps losing. Like over and over and over again, he keeps losing. He can't. He can't figure out a way to. Uh... 
I like that gives me orange. That gives me orange. It gives me nothing. That gives me okay. So orange is just the way that the game interprets a hit onto anything. All right, we're going over there to total defense. Hey, it's on our map. Oh, that's one that says find a way into the outpost. Got it. Hold on. Okay, now we're going to the farm. Never mind. Anyway, he's playing dark and darker, and he keeps losing. Keeps losing, and he, and he, and he gets mad, and he's like, he's like, I don't know how I'm losing. He's losing because every single time he has the opportunity to heal one of his party, instead of healing his party, he will blind. He will try to blind the other party. And his reasoning is, if they're blind, they won't be able to hit me. I'm like, yeah, but you have to blind them first. And then the blind is like 50-50. But number one, maybe, maybe you blind them. Two, maybe... That looks ominous. Looks ominous. Looks like super ominous. Just a huge red light everywhere, man. What that? Is it just, is it wood? I think I'm okay on wood, thanks. Holy crap! What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Explain this to me. Explain this to me. <laughs> oh. Oh. I thought it was a s demonic newspaper, but it's just written in Swedish. I think. I don't know. I don't, I don't read Swedish. All I know is that Utamerdentlet means, like, good job or something. Or wonderful, I think. Wonderful. Utamerdentlet. It's wonderful. They like putting things on plates. The fl the adrenaline shot in that building was on a plate. That was on a plate. I'll go ahead and just turn that off. All right. Well, that was a creepy situation. But anyway, I just I had to stop watching it. I had to stop watching it. Like, he was literally, like, like dying. Like, he was losing. Because in that game, when your people die, there's a chance they're gone forever. And he was losing these people forever. And he was getting so frustrated. He was like, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. It's like, heal your people. Heal them. Heal them. Give, give, them, give them more hit points every single round than they had the previous round, if you can. Like, heal them. Oh, two. Oh, my goodness. One, two. Three, four of the big guys. We're going to find a way into that. Holy crap. Is that the only thing that's in there? Oh, dude, I could probably take one of them right now if I got him in the back. Ooh. Oh. All right, what else we got? I see no more movement in the compound. It's probably just those four. Everything's okay. Oh. Doggo. The doggo and the big guys are a real brutal combination. Because the, the these guys right here, uh, I mean, they have the hit points to get into your... Oh, they're... they're, they're Are they turning around? Interesting. Maybe they're just a roaming patrol. Where'd that doggo go? Hello, doggo. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's right. Come over here alone. Come over here and figure out what happened. That's right. That's right. 
Coming out here alone is the smart thing to do. Whoa! Whoa! I respect that. I respect that play, doggo. I really do. I respect that a lot, actually. <laughs> I'm surprised I'm actually hitting them. You know what I mean? Oh my god. Stop, 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 stop. Nope, 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 nope. No, 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 no. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> now see that that's that's not fair i can't see them but they can see me come on now i had to make that shot count i didn't have another one <laughs> all right two doggos down the roaming patrol is gone oh jeez. oh jeez. You know, he's, he's so far away. He probably can't see anything. All right, let's turn over to the... He's right there. And it really, I like the... I like the submachine gun, I think, for the close-in work here. Find a way to access the readiness store in the barn. Damn, that guy's close. It's a doggo. He's close, man. He is so close. Hunting rifle, please. Please give me the hunting rifle. Okay, who else? Is Fatty McFattenstein, is he coming to? I hear him, he's so close. Oh, there, oh there's, there's bob wire, you can't jump over the bob wire. Open the door. Open the door! And now shut the friggin' door. Okay. All right. Okay. And we're we're looting. Is that what I'm? Is that what I'm understanding here? We're looting. Okay, great. They can see through walls. They can see through walls. They're seeing you right now. Okay. Can't open doors, though. Oh, he just came in the back way. Okay, wonderful. Wonderful. I just, I just came in the back way. Okie dokie. Okay, that doesn't have anything on it. This has something on it. What is it? This is heat vision. I don't want heat vision.
outside the building. I know anything about anything. Holy crap. He walked off to the left. Mm. There's two of them. Oh, Jesus. There's three of them. One, two, three. Oh, Lord. Okay. All right. I hope I did that mission. I hope I did that mission. There's one there. There was one over there, and then there's one over there. And then the four big guys walked off in that direction. Okay. What is that? What is that? A motorcycle sign? I don't know. I don't know what that is. It's an airport or something. I don't know. There's a motorcycle sign over there, and I don't have the motorcycle yet. It'd be nice to get the motorcycle. And that's why... And that's why we have the thermal scope. There's so many of the big walkers, man. So many of the big walkers. But there. All the goodies are supposed to be up that way. There's like a safe house or something. I don't know. We're here. I think that enemy base is here. Let's walk down this road. Oh, dude. Man, that, that thermal scope twice has come in handy. It spotted that enemy base and the four doggos, and it just spotted another doggo up here. So good. All right. Oh, missed. Oh, missed. Oh, missed. Whoops. Here the doggos come. That's not one of the biggest ones, but that's still an unhappy. Oh, come on. There we go. Missed every one of those shots, man. Settle down. Yeah, that big guy's coming there. Or maybe not. I don't know what he's doing. You know what I find interesting is that the doggo, their fuel tank, where they're most vulnerable, is 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 uh, it's not hot. But I wonder if this guy's the same way. It probably not. Oh f, f he's running. Okay. Okay. Oh, ball sack! Come on. Game is so difficult to get the damn weapon you want. Look at that. Oh. He's too far away. I'll miss the shot. Oh 
Yeah, well, here he freaking comes now. Oh my lord, he's right here. We're at nine health. Oh, there's another one over there in the field. We're boned. We are boned. It was a good run. Yeah, that's us. Oh, but by all means, don't switch your weapon while you're running. Yeah, don't. There we go. Good job. Uh, yeah, we're going to use an adrenaline shot. Now, technically, with the adrenaline, we should have, like, unlimited stamina. Switch to the, to the first aid pack. There you go, buddy. There you go. Take one of those. Yeah, there you go. Eat your vitamins. And one more of them. All right, good job. A little bit of offense going, not the pistol. Okay, let's just kind of see what we're dealing with here. Okay, still coming on strong. Still coming on strong. All right, can I get can I get goose stuff, please? Can I get the big? There we go. Perfect. Wonderful. Is it doggos? I think I think we've engaged. There, doggos. Okay. Okay, got it. Got it. Got it. Don't bring up. The pistol again. <sighs> F. All right. Jeez. Well, that guy's terrifying. Is he on fire? Did I hurt him? Maybe that's just the fire that comes out of his face when he's trying to kill me. Too many doggos. Too many, too many bad. That's, and that's a, that's kind of why I didn't like this game. Is that everything is, like, like, like it, it's kind of not fun, you know? <laughs> like, oh, those those big machines, they can run super fast. <laughs> they always have doggos around them. Like, there's there's no downside. I do want to destroy that. That's some kind of transmitter beacon. I just, I just kind of hate always being alone and always hate kind of like losing a fight and having to run away, you know? See you in hell. Uh -huh. And like that right there, that would like, like attacking him from the top, if that would have like destroyed. Missed. Dang. That was me. I missed. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. Is it? Am I out? If I'm out, don't bring the weapon back up. Holy crap. Is that the nice one? Dude. Okay. I think I'm out of healing. Oh. Oh. That's how I'm dying. Not from that guy, but from the that roaming four-man patrol that we saw earlier. Medical supplies, please. Oh, I'm dead. Great. Uh, I guess we'll try one more time. That's... I don't know what that is. I need to get someplace and lay down. Okay, here. Lay down. I backpack. And we just randomly go through a thousand million different things till we find these. Tie it to a slot. Number two. Back out. Get the number two slot. We're going to hit that. We're going to heal up. Okay. And we have a damaged guy out there. Like we used our blow up rounds on a on a guy. B inspect. Claim the control point. Claim the control point. We need command tokens. Neutral command center. What? Command tokens. How do you get command tokens? What the crap is a command token?
I don't know what a command token is. Hey, but we are at 45 minutes. Uh-oh. And they cross a bridge. And you cross a bridge, you piece of sh I don't think they can. This is me just raging that I can't ever kill anything. And everything has more damage than me, and has higher output than me. This is a little cheesy. Hey, but this is what you get, you know. Outsource your water robots. I can't even hurt him. Like four or five clips in. You see what I'm saying? Like four or five clips in, shooting him in what I assume is his head, and it's not even. He's not even phased. He's just gonna stand there. Like, where, where's the fun in that? You know? Like, where's the fun? Like, where does the player think that they're actually doing work? This game, this game, I guess, like a lot of other games, is meant to be played with a bunch of people. And if you play with like eight people, then everybody shoots like nine times, and everybody feels great because they did damage to it. And I don't know, man. I can't. I don't know. I stopped playing this game for a reason. The doggos can come across the bridge, I bet. Doggos will figure it out. Ow! Railgun to the old, old base there. That's not good. Why won't they die? Oh my lord. One accidentally died. I gotta go. I gotta go. We'll pick it back up in the next video. Thanks for watching. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And if you have a moment, please like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye-bye.